after some experience with this, you learn to work with your mouth closed. <laughs> to do this job, uh, you've got to have kind of a strong stomach in a lot of areas. You're going to have to realize that you're going to get nasty on you any way you look at it. Uh, people will go out and say, oh, we can get cow stuff on us all the time, no issue, but boy, put human on us and we don't like this. Uh, it's, it's a psychological thing. Uh, waste is waste, you know, I mean, human waste, you got your animal waste, but uh, you've got to have to have a strong stomach because you obviously are going to get the odors and you're going to get the, the, the material on you, which uh, some people detest that quite a bit. And, and so. Top 10 things not to do, don't fling it on your partner. It's a good it's a good profession. It's a great profession. It's never going to go away. You're always going to have the 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 need to protect the environment. If they really want to get into this profession, they can be introduced into the profession by the operators and they'll take them they want to put in a day or two days just to uh, shadow an operator or shadow a collections person to see if this is something that they want to do. Our doors are always open to help teach, train, and show, to help train people, the younger, especially the younger generation coming up, if this is something that they want to do.